oh, but who am I to write a book? That's called imposter syndrome. That's a belief that you have. Who you are to write a book is you're two steps ahead of some guy that wants to buy what you know. That's who you are to write the book, right? You don't need to say, I'm a PhD. You can say, I'm a grade 12. You're a grade 10. I can teach you. I have to say, Alexis, when I first started my business 16 plus years ago, um, social media was just becoming the thing. And Mm -hmm. I can tell you, I stayed two weeks ahead of everybody I was teaching and they were paying me to teach them. Yeah. So you're absolutely right. As long as you're two steps ahead. And that is the best way to learn, too, because they're asking you all those questions that you didn't even know you needed to know. And you're having Mm -hmm. to go find out the answers if you don't know them because they expect you to know them. And it's not like it's so crazy because it's compartmentalized to just week one, just Mm -hmm. week two. And if you're always two weeks ahead, that's how I teach you to create a course. Go create lesson one and two and then go promote it and sell it and get people in your group. That's what the market research is about is asking people, would you buy this? And then if they would buy it, then while they're doing week one, you're figuring out week three and you're asking them, hey, what do you like about this? What questions do you have? And when they say, oh, I want X, Y, Z, then you can say to them, oh, that's coming in a further week, in a further module. And they'll go create it. 